In Lothark, they did not have to look far for their witch hunter. Numerous people were able to point the party in the direction of Raven's whereabouts. He was currently staying at the local inn and tavern. He's a popular fellow. When did she join us? Hmm. Kambara snorted. If he's in the tavern, should we strike him down? Yes. <laughs> yeah, there's Kambara. I don't think that is wise. We're likely to just end up in jail. Again. Fair. Actually, wait, no, screw you, game! The game sent us to jail before! Oh, whatever. Have it your way, so long as he eventually dies, and not in the, like, dies of old age kind of way. Oh, they have to kill him! I could just take him out of home for you instead! No. But if we could. No. Kamara instantly reduced in size and transformed into a black cat. Ah, oh, she's so cute now. Same hiss. Oh my god, she sounds like a lich! She's a lich! Draco bent down to pet the cat, but it hissed at him. Ah, still moody though. Leave her alone and let's go. I think I hear him already. Bren led the group into the tavern next to them. The cat weaved in between their legs, hopped up on a table, and inconspicuously started licking its fur. There. <laughs> oh, right. Oh, hello. Saren pointed across the room at the boisterous man dressed in the same peculiar clothes that they had found in the swamp. It's high noon. What do I have to do to get some service in this rotten place, bub? He slammed his tankard on the table with a loud thud. The barmaid scurried over to get it. But when she returned, turned to refill it, Raven smacked her on the rear. She squealed and tossed his drink back at him. He shot up. Watch it. I'm the best at what I do. And what I do happens to be sexual, sexual, harassment. sexual harassment in your workplace. He shook his hat before placing it on his head. Goddamn wench almost ruined my hat. Friends, hands. Well, that's good that we're not going to feel bad when we murder Sarah hoped shit. that she wouldn't attack. Not in here. No one can take a compliment these days. Ooh, this guy is not making it out of here in one piece. Think fast. He flipped a gold coin to the insulted barmaid. It bounced off of her and to the floor. Don't throw change at people. This guy, like, at least they have successfully signaled that this man is, like, a complete douche and that we should not feel bad. Captain Animu headed for the door, causing party members to suddenly act like patrons and hide their faces. The witch hunter thankfully passed them without noticing. Come on. Come on. We have to follow him. And probably fucking beat the shit out of him. They followed Raven in secret as he traveled through the city. He threw lazy greetings at people as he passed and tipped his hat to especially beautiful women. Oof. So far, they were successfully undetected. He was a terrible hunter. He left the city entirely and walked to the nearby woods, piquing their interest. Perhaps he had a campsite he was returning to. No, he's leading us into a trap! After quietly sneaking behind him for so far... <laughs> like, what are we, a team of eight right area, now? <laughs> ten, I think. Ten. He stopped and adjusted his hat. All right. Now that we're out of the city, it's about time you explain to me why you're tailing me. With these senses, I can pick you up from a mile away. Saren sucked in a breath. <gasps> so he knew all along he was being followed. Loren stepped out of hiding first and confronted him. Raven, Raven casually turned around, looking slightly amused. We had to stop your hunt for the Witch Kambara. Oh yeah. What's in it for you? Kambara. She's... Is she here right now? What did she this time? A crow? Enough chatter. Loren took out her swords, but Saren rushed forward. We won't kill you if you promise to give up witch hunting. That's adorable. No, sir, no way. I'm not that much of a pushover. Not since they replaced all my bones. Saren sighed, still fixed on finding a peaceful solution, even though his patience was already thin. There had to be a way to reason with him. Where is my romance option? I don't understand. Why do you want to hunt witches? Because they're evil. 
It's the same reason you hunt down demons without a second thought. Bad things deserve to be punished. It's the decent thing to do. I've been naughty. Do I deserve to be punished? Tips Fedora. Saren didn't believe him. Raven thought himself above decency back in the tavern, so there had to be another reason. Ooh. Blood! Blood! You crave battle? You can't sit still in one place for too long? And you need something to occupy your time, so you picked up witch hunting as a hobby. And Kambara has been a thrilling chase. I really wish we could have told him a joke. Am I right? Well, looks like we got a, we got a storyteller on our hands. You don't know anything about who I am, so why even try? This answer is what you would have gotten no matter what option you would have picked. We know enough. We know that we watch you at the tavern. You're very rude. Must not have been looking at me, then. Do you bother women often, Raven? What inferno are you talking about? Boy, you better check yourself. There had to be more to it. What the <laughs> fuck? What? Selfishness. Has your ego become too inflated by your hunting fame that you think you can treat people however you want? Fame was the right answer. <laughs> Why are you asking all these questions? You think I'm just going to give up my career because you asked me? I'm the best at what I do, Bob. I so I don't want to say Kambara is not evil. That because I'm not convinced in any way. I don't shape think or that form. that's not tr that that's true. <laughs> I I don't think that that's relevant in this in this context. But uh, she is. Yeah, I don't think he deserves better. I think he deserves a like a sweet swift kick in the head and an ex and like a uh, long trip out of town. Fair. Uh, so let's go with Kambara is needed. The world is at war and Kambara is, a cru is crucial to saving Aragorn. You may not believe that, but it's true. The whole world is watching you now, right at this moment, for you to make the right decision and spare her life. History has its eye on you. Raven sucked on his teeth while nervously studying the group. Boys. Heavily armed men stepped out from behind the trees with crooked grins on their faces. It's gonna be a pity killing such fine looking people. But that's just how the story goes. First you, then the shapeshifter. Cause I'm the best at what I do, bub. Loren gladly rushed into battle. Yeah, no, that was way longer than it. What was going on there? Uh, oh, we don't have to have Sazer anymore. Do we want to get... Uh, yeah, yeah, he's... Tanksman back? Tanksman is a good time. I like Tanksman. Oh, we forgot to re-equip Shooty McShooterton. Oh. Can we do it now? Can, can we? That's nice. Yep, that's better. Not... Yep, substantially not better, better, but, but yeah, like, but better. better. I'll, I'll take better. Alright, we, we have now recruited. Jesus, this motherfucker's got 500 hit points. Oh, he's weak to fire, though. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, <laughs> uh, alright. Yeah, so, uh, do we want to just ignore those elves? Because they don't do anything except shoot us, right? They're weak to fire. The I, the whole front row is weak to fire. So right, why don't we so just start just... whittling this dude down? Yeah. yeah. Um... There isn't really an appreciable difference. We just... Yeah, yeah, that does more damage overall. Yep. Yeah. Siren, get in there, brother. Oh, he has Ooh, a Ooh, Ooh, Jesus, we just died. We just oh. went down. Oh, no. Oh, no. Um, we've got a resurrect potion, don't we? Um, but she's also got resurrection spells. Oh, yeah. But we've also got the ability to do terrible things and slow down that entire thing, right? Yeah, let's do that. Yeah. Let's... Yeah, that's We helpful. slowed down a couple of people... Uh, and we nearly kill some people. That seems like a great thing to do. Uh, then we, can, I, we, we can have Loren or Ammo keep Yeah, back. we we can worry about getting back up if we kill people. Like, so I suggest we. What do we got? So, Loren, Ammo Kiki. So Ammo Kiki can defend us. Let's Loren pick him up. Ammo Kiki. Yeah, because one of those potions will. The purple does the purple get us back up? Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, and then Emukiki can defend us. Shield wall. Ooh! Yeah, I had a bad day. Okay. Oh, our wizard is pretty low, too. Okay. Uh, do we want to heal our wizard? Because wizard's going to be... He's essential to our... Uh, kill everything, yeah. Oh, no. wait. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. We had another option. Another option. Yes, that sounds much better. Yes. Than a healing potion. Yeah. Okay, now All right, she definitely needs to kill. Uh, let's go with the. Slowed? Yeah, let's kill him. And then she should kill him. Hmm, darn. Yeah, we can just weaken them or we can start taking shots. Well, wait, what is our. Uh, so it's Dora, Dora and Mukiki. Emukiki can punch the guy, the really weak guy. Yeah, there we go. Alright, now we're in business. So again, I think we want to go for the slow. Yep. How much more damage does the other one do? It does more damage, but it doesn't have a... a 10% ca chance of causing tired, rather than... Yeah. What a, what's the other one? Slow. 45 for slow? Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Slow you down. What does the uh, her other power do? The bonk him on the head one. Um, oh, uh, I think it shows them backward if there's a space for them to okay. go. Uh, so, do we want to start on these two or? Uh, yeah, I think we do. We she does more damage hitting the back row anyway, right? Uh, yes. Question mark. Yes, you. All right, Draco. Here are your options, buddy. And we. What are our options to the back row? Literally kill everyone. Literally kill everyone. Literally kill everyone is the best choice. Try this on for size. Yeah. Uh, no, let's just take the shot. Uh, knocks the enemy down, dealing 125. Yeah. So yeah, yeah, it's Confu great. Confused doesn't seem like a good buy. It's just a magic reduction, but... Um, it's extra damage. It's extra damage. Oh, he's got a through strike. That's how he's hitting our back row. Okay. Um, these people are dead now, so it's literally just him. So we just now we just like slow arrows and minus him. Um, what is slit sixteen? What's normal? No, it's normal arrow arm. Because I think. Um. And we might want to pick up uh, our fallen comrade. And she's not going to do a ton of damage because she's just one guy, so let's heal him. Oh, oh, does it heal the whole row? Well, that's the best option anyway, I think. Okay. Moran. Yep. Just wail on this guy until he falls over. Alright, um... And what does normal staff do? No. Yeah. No, no. I don't this is like... There we go. Alright. What is that actually risking that? Raven's bandana. Oh. And another redwood bow for Sarah uh, Saren. Hooray! Blast it. You uh, You died, man. You died. We killed you. There we go. Okay, yeah. Raven clutched his chest and he fell to the ground. His hat rolled off and his body stilled. Alright. Alright. Uh. Souser. He's been dealt with. Now to tell come. Cat hissed next to Loren. She looked down, the cat transformed into Kambara. Finally, they could not have taken any longer. I'm sorry, but I thought we could talk it out, talk him out of it. Ah. Kambara's eyes had shifted from being hostile to invasive as they roamed Saren's body. He shifted uncomfortably. We've kept our end of the deal. You'll fight alongside us now, correct? She crossed her arms and sighed. The 
After Foster Laga is defeated, you may do as you wish. Alright, so, I mean, obviously... Uh, let's hit auto-assign. Yep. Yes, okay. Alright, so... Alright, so what cool things do you do? Necromancy. Heat blood. Full row of enemies with fire damage. Burning, okay, we've already, we already do fire damage. Water damage, same thing. Air damage, same thing. Earth damage, same thing. Dark damage. So it's uh, really just like pick several flavors. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go with dark damage because we don't do dark damage. Yeah. I suspect fewer things are gonna be strong or weak against that. What is the causing poison? Yeah, poison seems fine. Do extra damage. You just wanna like max it out? Yeah. Let's soul rot the hell out of these things, and then maybe. I'll say water. Like, water's been pretty useful. Frozen? Frozen seems nice. And it, uh, Frozen also, like, all the conditions just do extra damage. Alright. Kamara stepped into the ranks of Loren's army, now a full member of the party. She would always remind them of her desire to be back home, but she never failed to do her part. She spent more time for the, with the group. Her realization of the situation grew. So did her willingness to help, even if she had to mask it. All right, so let's, yeah, let's go to camp, and then we'll take a break. Yeah, go chat with our exciting new party members and old ones. God For damn it! Sake. <laughs> okay. Should we just, like, left to right now? Like, Yeah, let's just, just, just go left to right. All right, Dora. Oh, hi, Gan. Oh, oh, she's got nothing more to say. Because we're doing DLC stuff. We haven't, like... Okay, yeah, we haven't simply... progressed through the main quest, so... So, it really doesn't bother you. I'm sorry, oh, what? My ears. I don't even see your ears. Thank you. I mean, my lineage, silly. Why doesn't it bother you that I'm half-elf? I can't see race with your hair down. <laughs> yeah, you're supposed to hate half of me. Romance! No question. I don't... I don't think so. I can make up my own mind who not to like, and I like you. Blush. Really? Kirko started to finger his clothing nervously and found it hard to look at Saren again. You should be really careful with using the word finger as a verb in romantic situations. I, it just, it's yeah, I would confusing. Have gone with, I would have gone with fidget. Yeah, yeah. I thought you kind of did hate me. You were always yelling at me and stuff. Saren recalled how stern he had been with Draco in the past and understood. I apologize. That's how I talk. So you don't hate me then? Not even a little? <laughs> don't be silly. Don't be silly. I, I hate you. We will have the most marvelous of hate fucks. <laughs> Draco laughed and moved his nervous fiddling to his hair, pulling off his locks. Much better. Yeah, yeah, you're making it. You're getting there. One of his ears slipped from its prison, but Draco didn't notice. Too busy looking at everything that wasn't Saren. How oh, they put his ears out? Look at that. Neat. It was easy to consider Draco as, hum as a human, but it was his ears that betrayed his heritage. And his terrifying mastery of fire magic. And he never wanted to show anyone who he really was. Knowing the world better, perhaps it was for the best if it brought Draco the acceptance he deserved. You're, uh... Saren pointed to his own ears to alert Draco that his were exposed. Draco blushed even further as he turned away to tuck them back in. Ah, oh, good catch. Draco didn't turn around, back around, but left. <laughs> so he just backed away? Yep. <laughs> oh, no, wait, sorry. He turned around to fix his ears and wandered away. Got it. That, that, that did make sense. All right, Amu Kiki. You said you were from a group of people called the Nomads. Of the South. The Nomads of the South, I'm sorry. Nomads of the South. It's sort of like the Disciples earlier, and it's sort of the Disciples of Truth is really the truth part, the important part. Lots of people can be decided. Yes, who no, are no, they? No, Nomads of the South is my Spirit of the West cover band. Like, like a bluegrass Spirit of the West cover band? Hmm. Yeah, I like it. Uh... Yes, who are they? What are they like? Aren't they like the Empire? No. 
You're barbarians. We're going to no. flirt at the end of this. Our culture is different, not lesser. The term is not welcome to us. I had never thought of that. I had never thought of that term. What? I had never thought that that term was offensive. I'm sorry. So, now, in spoken English, that that is a common construction, but in written English, it's really, in written really English, awkward. You, you use that the. Um... It's it's more that that term. No, yeah, no, no. It's it's, yeah, it's, like... it's so so. It's interesting to me, like 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 the the game is sort of like interacted with a couple of like, um. Social justice issues, they, like this being one of like 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 this sort of application of of, of uh, diminutives to cultures. Yeah, and it is it is. It's weird to me that it, like, takes the time to engage with these things. It's like someone has a checklist and, like, no, 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 we need to engage with this. But it doesn't do anything interesting with it. Like, it, it is... Like, that that sentence is is sort of the archetypal piece of that, where they're like, okay, no, we, 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 th- we have the conversation with our, our fighter dude where, where this happens and, and yeah. we call him a barbarian and then we're like, we, we say this sentence because we want to, like, you know... Like, like, I am aware that this is an issue. Yeah. I didn't actually talk to anyone that knows anything about it, but I know it's an issue. Mm-hmm. So, I'm and, going and, to point we're out... Nev- we're never going to talk about it again. Yeah, that this is an issue. And it's, yeah, it's so weird. Though it is interesting how you are so quick to judge other cultures just the same. Like the elves, for instance. I fucking hate myself in this game. Mukiki was silent for a long time, refusing to comment. You know I'm right. <laughs> are you interested in nomads? Or insulting me? Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. Please, please tell me about your culture. Like... <laughs> I feel like this is a conversation that whoever wrote this has had in real life essentially verbatim. And that was the result. (laughs) All right. Ramus. My ex is getting restless. I'm sorry we died. We cycled you out of the party. Uh, Honestly, I think we cycled Dora out for Kambara. Uh, could be. So could that be. our whole back row just blows shit up. Uh, with you, Loren, last. Loren told me once that you were a very private person, even with her. Is that true? I want the answer to be yes, and then I have to close the dialogue. Yes. Private. Private. <laughs> she had to meditate on the accusation for a moment. Does she consider me a poor mother? No, sorry, that's not what she said at all. I can see what she means. I did not nurse or entertain her, nor confide in her with my personal problems. Those were mine to solve. Burdening others is a high offense. What does that mean? Like legally? Like I get, I get, I get that in like Amazon, in like Amazon life, it's we, we've observed that it's a social faux pas. Yeah, like like, yeah, it's. <laughs> <laughs> friendly we're like yeah like what are we gonna be forceful with this woman no, no just be like oh sometimes people want to take that burden away from you because they care refusing them could even be a higher offense be an even to be fair I yeah I was just not gonna correct myself it's... Karen reflected on what he had said Loren has never acted like she was interested in my affairs. Right I mean, until, I've had many. Right up until she, like, lit out from the Amazon kingdom to go and rescue your dumbass. In any case, she has turned out to be much stronger an Amazon than I could have hoped for. She will make an excellent queen, and I will distinguish her daughters that follow in her... And I wish her daughters that follow... What? 
I wish she will make an excellent queen, and, and I, I wish, wish her, her daughters, daughters that follow in her footsteps. footsteps. Period. That's uh, that's a thing that just no. <laughs> All right. I'm like, did you just have a stroke? <laughs> she did undergo like a lot of torture. Like yeah, I that's, suspect that's that she has some like. I'm not comfortable with the dark witch in our camp. Many of us aren't, but Loren deemed her safe, so we will welcome her for now. Oh, you feel it? The void that she carries with her. That's cool. I feel as though my own energy is being sapped from me. That's a true joke. Ha <laughs> sapped, 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 I get it. Truly, I have felt nothing. Are you in pain? I have a variety of healing skills that can help with that. You are the most renowned healer in the Amazon uh, Citadel. Um, no, I was going to say that truly I have felt nothing is my Linkin Park cover band. <laughs> it's going to go with Nickelback. Um, it's almost <laughs> too small to detect, but... Keep your distance from her, then. But how can I? I would have shared the same battlefield. Then our lives are each in each other's hands. I have to... Trust her! Please tell me if you suspect anything. I'm sure Loren would like to know right away, and I'm fairly certain that we know how this bridge of distrust is resolved. It's going to be sexy, and we're all going to be a little bit uncomfortable watching it happen. Hi! Oh, sorry for bothering you with this. Not at all. I'm going to try to end this with flirting. I don't know how I'm going to do it. Mercy seemed very upset with Kumbara's presence. Uh-huh. All right, <laughs> we'll talk to this dude. Do you remember his name? Nope. <laughs> Ray. Ray. His name is Ray. Yes. It's rather boring when I haven't killed anything in a while. <laughs> That's literally it. He just Saren can you slay on hands? Yes. Saren is a highly skilled healer. The dark witch was standing alone by the campfire. Saren looked around, unsure if she was Morrigan from Dragon Age or Lulu from Final Fantasy X at this point. Kambara didn't seem like the most friendly of companions, and simply speaking with her seemed to irritate her. But if she became friends with someone, perhaps that would change. I mean, we, like, basically arm-twisted her into coming. For no reason. We are not sure. No, we're literally like, you have powerful-ass witchy magic. We need it. What, what's it going to take for you to come with us? And blow shit up in our service. To be fair, like, adventuring parties have been founded on worse. <laughs> Kambara looked over her shoulder at him, sending cold chills through Saren. But she said nothing and turned back to the fire. After a few moments, Saren shook off his anxiety, cleared his throat, and walked up to her. Kamba, Did you get a good look? I'm sorry. Don't be coy. I'm aware I have an attractive rear end. You're wearing a cape. <laughs> yeah, like... Sarah gagged, realizing she thought he was ogling her from behind. Uh, no, I, I wasn't, I swear. I'm, I'm really? super into... I am super into Draco. What a shame. You miss your chance, and I doubt you will have another one. On account of I will have turned you into a tiny frog. Now, why are you here? I wanted to get to know more about you. Hey. Kambara stared at him blankly. Saren cleared his throat again. <clears throat> For instance, I wanted to know more about... His magic is kills you. <clears throat> Kambara suddenly yawned. That topic is boring. You're disappointing. Boring? Yes, his magic is kills you. <laughs> Sacrifices. Ah! Kambara's eyes flicked across Saren's abs. Uh, was she thinking about sacrificing him? Friendly. We can be friendly. We should tell her a joke. Okay. Do, do you really think that telling Kambara a joke is going to get anything... Uh, Alright. Fuck it. All right. Go ahead. You know you want to. <laughs> Who's there? Da. Da who? Dark magic is magic that kills you. 
That's a funny... Chammy? We're no. just going straight to Chammy. Uh, it's Hammy. That's a funny joke, Hammy. Ha. Ha. Hammy. Yes, joke. Ha. Hammy. Call me that again. You will see how much of, of joke it is. Duly noted. Good thing Loren didn't hear you with her no sense of humor. She likes to decapitate things. That is the funniest thing that this man has said so far. Yeah, that is why I like her. That's why we get along. Alright, Souser. Right. Souser, got boy. anything more to say? You mentioned someone named Iracha. Goddess Iracha, dude. Goddess of truth and like the disciple savior. Why do monks worship her? She's the deity who blesses the world with truth. It's quite simple, really. Except for like the whole youth of Fro thing. But like, we try not to think about that. If you're like wondering which came first, it was truth and then the goddess. Our temple's founder, the original master of truth, was a great unarmed specialist who helped others th see true reality through punching. I understand. Newton, you're talking about Newton. We're talking about, like, no, no, I'm at, I'm dude, at, like, dude, dude, dude. I'm talking about the master of truth. He like punched an apple one day, uh, and it uh, it refracted light through like a prism. So there's like three laws of truth, right? The first law. Wait, wait. Does it have to do with an object in motion stays in motion? Uh, no, dude. Truth isn't just about objects. Truth is about your hands. A fist in motion stays in motion. Dude! Oh, guys, this hurts. <laughs> True cool. reality? Rich, What's that? Rich clip that. <laughs> the naked world. The naked world is just like this world, only nobody wears any pants. No I'm, rules, I'm, no I'm, pants. I'm on board with your theology. Let's get forceful with this man. I don't know what it means. That sounds like just like religious nonsense to me. Dude. See, right? Like this kind of sentence. This is just like a person replaying conversations they have had. And, like, a very particular kind of person. I'm baffled how this game got made. You commission art, put together an engine. But, like, is this, like... Spend is this writing a dialogue. Yeah, like, is this... Like, no, this is made by a company. That, and that's the thing. Like, if this is a person's passion project, but if there is a team... There is. I don't believe it's very big, but there is. And, right. uh, and... Yeah, like, this This is... but the, 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 Like... These interactions, because... Yeah, no, like... Not, it, it's... Sa why is... Okay, I feel a little bit of, better about where Sazer's looking now. He's like... <laughs> he's got this, like, serious side-eye going on, but it's not for me. No. Like, he is giving, like, probably Kambara the, like, the dirtiest side-eye. Well, I mean, to be fair, he doesn't like dark wizards. I Fair. But, uh... He has had experiences. But yeah, like, normally when you're, when you're constructing dialogue for characters, you're like, okay, here's my objective in this, like, dialogue thing, and here's the thing I want the player to learn or the player to show. Um, and and this, like, weirdly, this feels more like dialogue with, in some ways, more like dialogue with real people. Mm. In that you can, like, have a conversation that doesn't really go anywhere. Yeah. Um, you have a lot of those in this game. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but, well, you have a lot of those, and like, like again, like the the game I would compare this to is Dragon Age, um, and you you have a lot of those in Dragon Age too as well, but um, like there's there's always that a dialogue line where you're like trying to get the player to like you're trying to introduce concepts to the player, for mm. instance. Like Morgan spends most of her time talking about her mom, and then later on you're going to go and fight Morgan's mom. Mm-hmm. And, like, find the Black Grimoire and all kinds of things like that. Yeah. I don't take offense to that. So, like, don't worry. Uh, I know that the life I chose isn't, like, the life for everyone. 
That's a really weird way to end a conversation. Then they kiss. Kissing doesn't break vows of celibacy. No, uh-huh. no, it doesn't. And also it does often end conversations. Mm-hmm. So, hence... <laughs> Did anyone else threaten you? <laughs> Lorraine had been obsessing over Saren's safety since the attack in the elf's forest. Once again, once again, princess, I am fine, but thank you. Hmm. It's very uncalled for. I hope the elven government takes a long look at themselves for allowing that to happen. And then they arrest you. If Mirth hadn't been there, well, I, I don't know what I would have done. I would have killed everyone. I, I would have just murdered all So of now them. I'm really confused. Was Saren the only one arrested? Was everyone else just been like, could you please come along? We've arrested this guy. Oh, Saren was the one that actually killed someone. Yes. Everybody else just had to fight off the sure. gang. Okay. But she was there, and everything is all right. You may calm down. Again, conversations that a real person has had, like in a fantasy context. Yeah. You may calm down now. Elves are supposed to be gen- a gentle people. At least it's the other that Murph gives off. Most certainly was not gentle. The other two elves we've met, one is a fucking pyromaniac and the other one is a literal assassin. I'm very flattered you let this get to you, but it's okay. The wren blinked and looked away. I will decide what I'm upset about, not you. Yes, ma'am. 